Now that you know how to wire the ES24V, let's move on to the function and setting of the control. The ES24V has three operating modes, off, on, and eco mode. Off mode turns everything controlled by the ES24V off and enables the control to comply with building codes requiring on-off and manual override functions. This is the default mode when the control is powered on. On mode turns everything controlled by the ES24V on and enables the control to comply with building codes requiring on-off and manual override functions. This is an override mode and does not account for the temperature or humidity limit settings. Use this mode for testing and balancing during the initial fan or damper installation. Eco mode limits the ventilation operation during periods of extreme temperature and or humidity. The temperature and humidity sensors evaluate the fresh air conditions continuously. While the fresh air temperature and or humidity is within the user set limits, the fresh air fan or motorized damper will run for the user set amount of time per hour. When the fresh air temperature and or humidity exceeds the user set limits, the fresh air fan or motorized damper will turn off and enter a check cycle. During this check cycle, the fan or damper will run for five minutes every 15 minutes to evaluate the fresh air temperature and or humidity and to meet minimum run time per hour code requirements. The fan will continue this check cycle until the fresh air temperature and or humidity are within the user set limits. We've reviewed the function of the ES24V, now let's learn how to set it. First, let's go over the screen indicators and what they mean. In the top left corner of the screen, you will see which mode the control is set to, off, on, or eco. In the middle, you will see the relative humidity percentage and temperature measured by the sensors. On the bottom are the indicators for the fresh air fan, duct heater, motorized damper, and HVAC blower. To begin setting the control, press and hold the mode button for three seconds you will see 01 and setup appear on the screen. The first setting is the duct heater. Press up or down to enable the duct heater. The duct heater default setting is disabled. Once enabled, you will see heat on on the screen. Press set to confirm. If enabled, the duct heater will be on anytime the fresh air fan is on and the set point is greater than the fresh air temperature plus two degrees Fahrenheit. Next, you will see 02 on the screen. This is the temperature unit setting and can be either degrees Fahrenheit or Celsius. The default setting is Fahrenheit. Press up or down to change the setting and set to confirm. Now you will see 03. This is where you will choose to evaluate temperature only, humidity only, or both temperature and humidity. The default setting is both. Press up or down to change the setting and set to confirm. Next you will see 04 which is the motorized damper setting. The default setting is disabled, indicated by the word no on the screen. To enable, press the up or down button to show yes and press set to confirm. If enabled, the motorized damper will be on anytime the fresh air fan is on. Now you will see 05, which is the optional HVAC blower integration. The default setting is disabled, indicated by the word no on the screen. To enable, press the up or down button to show yes and press set to confirm. If enabled, the HVAC blower will be on any time there's a call from the G input or any time the fresh air fan is on, excluding the check cycle. Last, you will see 06, which is the fan or damper runtime per hour in minutes. This can be set anywhere from five to 60 minutes in five minute increments. Use the up and down buttons to adjust the runtime and the set button to confirm. Now the control will return to the home screen so you can set your temperature and humidity limits and duct heater set point. Press the set button. You will see high limit temperature on the screen. Adjust the high limit temperature setting anywhere from 65 to 105 degrees Fahrenheit using the up and down buttons. When the fresh air temperature is above this setting, the fan or damper will not run for the set time per hour and will instead enter the check cycle. Press set to confirm. Next, you'll see high limit humidity on the screen. Adjust the high limit humidity setting anywhere from 55 to 90% relative humidity using the up and down buttons. When the fresh air humidity is above this setting, the fan or damper will not run for the set time per hour and will instead enter the check cycle. Press set to confirm. Now you will see low limit temperature on the screen. Adjust the low limit temperature setting anywhere from 20 to 60 degrees Fahrenheit using the up and down buttons. When the fresh air temperature is below this setting, 
the fan or damper will not run for the set time per hour and will instead enter the check cycle. Press set to confirm. Next you will see low limit humidity on the screen. Adjust the low limit humidity setting anywhere from 10 to 50% relative humidity using the up and down buttons. When the fresh air humidity is below this setting, the fan or damper will not run for the set time per hour and will instead enter the check cycle. Press set to confirm. Last, you will see heat on on the screen. Adjust the duct heater set point anywhere from 32 to 62 degrees Fahrenheit using the up and down buttons. When the fresh air temperature is below this setting, the duct heater will be activated anytime the fresh air fan is activated. Press set to confirm and return to the home screen. Now the ES24V is programmed. Change the operating mode from off to on or eco to begin operation. You can perform a factory reset at any time by putting the ES24V control into the off mode and holding both the up and down button for five seconds. The ES24V is safety listed to the UL standard 60730-1, automatic electrical controls for household and similar use, and can be used to meet the following fresh air ventilation standards and building codes. ASHRAE 62.2, 2010 through 2016, IECC, IRC, and INC 2012 through 2015. For more information, visit our website, or to order, call our customer service line Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern. Thank you for joining me today. This is Matt, your SMP product engineer, Solar and Plow, Advancing Ventilation.